hello welcome back to my channel um yeah my name is amori and let's get into the video all right so i asked you guys on instagram do you want to know how to get free clothes hair shoes whatever you could think of and every last one of y'all said yes like nobody said no nobody was trying to be funny like, like no everybody said yes so since y'all all did that i know that y'all want to know so i'm about to do this video to show you guys some tips to get free anything free stuff like who doesn't want free stuff so before we get started i just want to show you some examples of some free stuff that i've gotten that you can also get and maybe even more the videos linked below are the things that i've gotten for free so hopefully that gives you guys an idea of some of the things that you'll be getting so you should probably listen to me i'm about to tell you the tips now step number one is you need to have a social media account how do you think these companies are going to contact you if you don't use social media? I'm sorry, but you're going to have to use it. Get a social media account and start getting active on it. If you guys want um, a video on how to be more active on social media, I can do that for you. The social media platforms that I like to use are YouTube and Instagram. These, you're not limited to this. You can use TikTok. TikTok might be a good one just because you can get a lot of views fast. Step number two is make a video based off of the kind of things you want to get free stuff with. So I'll give you an example. My very first video on YouTube was a hair tutorial. I bought some hair. I wasn't even going to do YouTube. I just bought hair because it was time for me to buy some hair. And I bought some hair and I decided like, why don't I record myself doing my hair and I'll just, that'll be my first YouTube video. Because at the time, I was still figuring out if I wanted to do YouTube or not. So, I did it. And not even a month later, like, in that same month, like, maybe, like, two weeks later, a company reached out to me and they were like, Um, we saw your video on YouTube and we want to send you some hair so they can review on your channel. What? Like, I didn't even do nothing. All I did was post me doing my hair and I got sent free hair. That's when I started realizing that... You gotta post videos of things that you want free stuff in. And it's not all about the free stuff. It's all about just like getting opportunities and collaborating and trying new things. Because some things that have been sent to me, I've never tried before. So anyway, long story short, make those videos so you can get the free stuff, okay? When you're making a video, don't feel intimidated. Don't feel like you need to go out and buy clothes or go out and buy some hair use what's in your house already one of my first try on hauls i didn't buy any of that stuff like i did but i didn't buy it for the video these were stuff this was just clothes i had in my closet that were all from the same store so i just put them all together and then i tried them on and recorded myself and then that video ended up doing really really good and i got sent some clothes because of it so just post what you like and then companies will send you stuff that you like okay so trust me i got you just listen to me and i'm gonna help you okay step number one make a social media account step number two make those videos make some content for that social media account step number three this is gonna relate to step number two once you make that video your video needs to say the company's name all over it like you need to just like you need to act like the company's biggest fan no i'm just playing but make sure you put the company's um title in your title the company's name in your title in the description box you need to have the company's name the company's hashtags the company's website you need to have the company all over it all over the video and if you post it on instagram make sure you tag the company tag the hashtags to that company the reason why is because you got to get the company's attention so that they could be like oh she's posting a video about us she must really like doing this and then they're gonna be like we should send her some more stuff and they're gonna be like yeah send me some more stuff so make sure you do that number four is create a business email when i first started youtube i used my regular email and days later months later i would look and my spam and my junk mail and i would see companies that wanted to collaborate with me and it just didn't work out because i never got the email in time and then there i lost an opportunity so don't do that make yourself a separate account a separate email account so that when companies reach out to you they can reach you directly and then all the collaboration emails are all in one place and it's just really organized so my 
um, work, my business email is contactamori13 at gmail.com. So I put this email everywhere. So you can't be shy. You know how you go on Instagram and girls will be like modeling and they'll put their email. A lot of times I'll look and I'll be like, she ain't getting no business. Nah, she probably is getting business because ever since I put my email in my bio on Instagram, I've been getting business. So don't be afraid to put your email in your bio. Do it. Put it in your TikTok bio. Put it in your Instagram bio. Put it in your YouTube bio. And I'm telling you, the companies... You're just gonna be like, damn, like it's so much. Like telling you, I'm I'm manifesting it for you. You're gonna get a lot of companies to reach out to you the same way I've been getting companies to reach out to me. So make that separate email and stop playing. Step number five, let's say you did all steps one through four and the company never saw your video. You're like, yo, like I posted the video, I did what you said, like why haven't I gotten any business coming to me? Okay, so. I got this tip from this other YouTuber, her name is Naya, and I'll put her YouTube in the description box. So, you know, make sure you guys go check out her video. She doesn't know me, but I just like this tip that she gave, so I'm gonna share it with you guys. So, let's say they didn't see your video, and you're like, yo, like, come on, like, I put that whole video out, and they're not even gonna say nothing? Like, <laughs> I'm moving out, so I don't have furniture, so I'm sitting on, like, a box right now. But I'm doing this for y'all, okay? So, let's say you're like, yo, like, they still didn't see my video. Take the video that you did with that company. Let's say you did a Shein try-on haul. This is the example she gave. Go and send that video that you made, the Shein try-on haul, directly to Shein. Do it. Like, just send the video to Shein on Instagram. I actually found this tip, like, two days ago. So, I definitely tried it out. But I haven't heard back from them because it's only been two days. But if you guys want, I can comment. I'll pin my comment down below. Ew. <laughs> I'll pin my comment down below letting you guys know what Shein wrote me back. Because I did a Shein haul and I messaged them saying like, I'll put the DM here. But you know, send the video that you created already to that company. Sometimes they'll write you back and they'll be like, oh, this is great. We want to send you some more stuff. We want to collaborate with you. So if the opportunity isn't knocking on your door, sometimes you got to open the door and shove the opportunity in their face. Put yourself out there. Put yourself in the position to receive free stuff, receive blessings, okay? I'm going to help you with that. Okay, so let's say you don't have a YouTube and you don't have a video and you have nothing to send them. If you're on Instagram, I'm pretty sure you've got some clothes. I'm pretty sure you got some hair from this company that you paid money for and tag them in the photo. If the company sees like, oh, people do like this hair on this girl, they might send you some more um, hair. So, you know, put yourself out there. Don't be afraid to put yourself out there, okay? okay this is step number seven this is the last step and i feel like it's gonna be the most helpful just in case you feel like discouraged or you feel like i'm not getting anything like i don't know what to do it's not working listen to step number seven i said it for the end what you really need to do to get the free stuff is you have to be active on social media one of the things that's great is that you can get free stuff no matter the amount of followers you get. I don't want you to feel like you can't get the stuff. You definitely can. You just have to put yourself out there and be consistent. You can't be afraid to post your videos. Every single time I have a new YouTube video, I post it in my Instagram story. I post it on Snapchat. I even post previews to my videos on TikTok. And what that does is the more platforms I post it, the more like I spread. I had to learn the hard way, but being consistent is definitely what has gotten me all of this free stuff. Being consistent means posting at least once a week. Try to grow your channel. And as your channel grows, those companies were gonna send you stuff. I did a nail tutorial and a company sent me some nail stuff. I do a try on haul, a company sends me clothes. And okay, so this this was random. I don't know what gave me them to send me these. I mean, they're obviously fake, but it's free. So these are the sneakers, they sent me these. But you know, the more you grow, the more companies will wanna jump onto your platform and want to promote themselves. So don't give up. I'm telling you, do not give up because there were so many times I wanted to give up. 
don't give up keep going comment down below if any of these tips work for you if you have some tips that you want to share with other people because i'm sure we can all benefit from it and that is the end of the video if i left anything out i apologize but these are definitely like the major tips and i'll see you guys in the next one